Happy Friday, everyone. I'm Minty Best, and I have Howard with me here from Gaming Today. Howard, you just missed an exacta yesterday. How do you feel? Feeling a little better. I didn't cash the ticket, but it feels like the handicapping is starting to come around. Have yeah. to improve after last week. Absolutely. It can't, it can't get any worse, right? <laughs> yeah, it could always get worse. That's but, yeah, true. It, yeah it, it was pretty bad. Perfect. Okay. Um, but yeah, not bad at all yesterday. It was fun to watch. Um, today you're taking us to Oaklawn, is that right? Oaklawn, race eight. I was looking at Gulfstream a little bit for the folks that are playing out there today, and it's Gulfstream and Oaklawn as the primary tracks. There's weather issues in both places, but it looks like there could be serious rain in Florida at Gulfstream later in the afternoon. So part of the reason I didn't give it a hard look was this okay. weather issue. Mm -hmm. Okay, that makes sense. All right, so who do you got today? Oaklawn race state to six furlong allowance race. And when I was watching the races yesterday, I noticed that all of the six furlong races, there were about five or six of them, only mm -hmm. one horse led from gate to wire. So I think there's now a pattern where the closers will have a chance to be in the mix. And that's what I'm looking for. And I think there's a lot of speed in this race. My top choice is number five, Mojo Vation. Um, oh, his last race, he ran second and it didn't look like on the form, he did such a great job. But on the thoroughgraph sheets, his number's very good. He went four lengths wide when they turned for home, and it basically cost him the race. But oh. speed-wise, I think he's the top choice. Number 10, Colonel Clink, comes from Chicago off a bit of a break, and he should go right to the front. He's very fast, and he's going to try to dictate this whole race. And that's where I think it may come apart, but he could hang on for second or third. Uh, the third choice is number two, Curate. And that's for trainer Peter Miller. In fact, there's three Southern California trainers of notoriety mm -hmm. in this race. Peter Miller, John Sadler, and Phil D'Amato, who are all very accomplished. So this race is pretty salty. Um, number two curation and Troy being back on a fast surface. His last race was on the mud. He hated it. He's back with trainer Peter Miller, and he should be there as well. So win place on number five, Mojovation. Exact the box, 2 five, ten. And then for the trifecta, I'm going to throw in the four. So it'll be two, four, five, ten for the trifecta box. Nice. Thank you so much, Howard. Everyone, that was Howard of Gaming Today. Give him a follow at Gaming Today News. Good luck, Howard, and have a great day. Thanks, Minty. Best to wager talk. Thanks.